church we we need to show off god in a new way we have to wrestle when i say wrestle don't take me wrong I, that's the only word i'm getting close we have to wrestle with god until our dna becomes so powerful that it is not controlled that our spirit man is not controlled by your external factors but it is living with god 24 bar 7 like that of a daniel who lived in exile but he was never exiled in the spirit he lived with god he walked with god and sooner or later he was the one who liberated a nation he was more powerful than the king because the king had to depend on him i believe that is possible in our generation now and that is why when when i hear the men of god crying out for a second great awakening you know you know what that actually means awakening ourselves to a new reality of god that we have not found in the last decade mambra ka seke tele me onto that the fire of god will be tangible in our life that it is not going to be according to yesterday's god we are known it will be the god we know today yes. come on now riko sekori antaraba lanto robo i don't know about you but i feel something god is provoking you know provoking is also a bad word god is stirring god is stirring god is stirring and even the stirring when i look at paul's words it is so interesting he says stir up the gift You know what's the picture that comes to my mind? I'll be me. Have you seen a cup of tea? Yeah, all of you have coffee, cup of tea. You can have sugar, three sachets next to you, and you can have a teaspoon. But until you open that sugar, put it into the coffee, and you stir it. Your coffee will never get the sugar you have in your hand neither will the sugar get into the coffee until you take the ownership of stirring your own sugar with your own coffee that is the language of paul he is like the holy spirit has been given to you and to me stir up the gifts of the holy spirit inside of you don't sit quiet don't allow the world around you to dictate what you have and you do not have allow that which is in you to be stirred up by you people of god this is the time and the hour we have to rise up and say i am not going to be a victim i have something in me which the world does not have i have the son of god i have the living spirit of god taking residence inside of me and out of my belly shall flow rivers of living water the thing 